Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here and welcome to another video. Ladies and gentlemen, today uh, we have the new Voler, Voler card? Voler, Voler? We'll call him Voler for the sake of the review. Uh, we're taking a look at someone who is 5'11", high medium work rates, right footed, three star skills with a four star weak foot. Uh, this card in game has the finesse shot traits as well as the power header traits and the chip shot traits, which is definitely very helpful. In game attributes, the card is set up very nicely uh, to give him, let's see here. Okay, so it's just an engine chemistry style flex. So engine chemistry style for a controlled player. So the pace will be in a good area at a high medium work rate. He does have an average body type. Uh, base card stats for passing is going to be in a decent area, right? Considering the fact that he's mostly going to be used as a striker. With the passing stats as it is, I wouldn't recommend playing him in the side positions, although you definitely could um, if you are going to be using this card in your team. Like, it's one, it's a possibility, of course. Uh, dribbling we will be experimenting with because with this card having uh, really good dribbling stats in general, we do have to take into consideration that when it comes to the dribbling, he does have an average body type. So, uh, obviously, we'll be taking a look at that in-game. Uh, when it comes to passing, it's good. Dribbling, we'll be experimenting with. Shooting is already in a very good area. This card is right-footed while working with a four-star weak foot. The thing is that when cards cost this much money, I really feel like it would be really nice if they just gave them the five-star weak foot, you know? Because um, I feel like when you don't have the skill moves, it makes your play style more linear when it comes to, like, just regular left stick and stuff. But... Obviously, we'll see what we can work with regardless. Uh, this card can win the ball in the air with 97 heading accuracy and 96 jumping. So obviously some good stuff there if you actually want to go for some crosses, right? Uh, physical stuff, he does have 87 aggression. So obviously a huge plus there as well. Uh, most people will be giving him the engine. It makes the most sense to improve his dribbling as much as possible. Uh, in game, guys, we will be using him as an actual striker. Uh, we'll play him up top in a 4-2-3-1 formation playing only on state central. So um, yeah, we'll see how he plays up top. Hopefully he is a beast. Oh, empty net. You know what? That was a, that was a decent finish by Voller. That's a really bad angle to hit it from. That was a really rough skill move. No, the EA. Please, the side-footed shot when you do power strikes, you got to remove that, man. I'm doing power strikes. There's no reason for him to finesse it there. Dude, I... Oh, that, I hate that animation, man. It ruins the play, like... Oh, beauty of a strike. Beauty of a strike. This Al Owarin card, I don't know if I'm saying his name right. He's he's really good, man. Oh, oh, what's happening? Oh, there's so many random things there. Beautiful Voller. You know what's hilarious? I just left against this guy because he scored two garbage goals against me in the beginning, and now we have two goals up against him. Oh, man. I thought I had that there, to be fair. Especially since I worked the extra dribble there. Look at that. 
And now he's going to leave, you see? I just conceded two horror. This is why I don't like quantity amount. Do you guys see what I'm saying? This is why I don't like quantity amount, man. What a goal. What a goal. Well-weighted pass to initially start it off. Baller in the right position at the right time. Great finish. Wow, he just sent him on just a regular left stick touch. That was crazy. Wow. It was a really good pass. I'm using uh, Rafinha just because of the sake of the review, but obviously if it's another player, might be a throw on goal right there. Oh my goodness, the state of that. The state of that, man. I messed that up. Should have done the extra pass there, actually, because I had the extra pass angle. I just didn't use it. Oh, man. I was expecting like a bigger drag there, but it didn't work. Oh, he scored that under pressure. That would have been beautiful. Too close. Yeah, too close. No way. No, 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 no. This crossbar stuff. What is that, man? Oh, I'm lucky we're getting our body there. Would have been good if we still had it the whole time. Oh. Good finish. And yeah, we'll take that. We'll take that. No, almost got a defensive play. Good goal, boys. Good goal. Oh, he's offside. Come on, man. Come on, EA. Oh, I'm trying to get a cross off to him. I should probably go for a ball roll cross. Oh, nice try. Nice try. Oh, come on. Ugh. Let's go, boys. Good play. Oh. Okay. Nice, bowler. That's the finish we needed there, man. On his weak foot, too. Try to get the finesse shot angle there, just couldn't. Well done, boys. Well done, that's what we needed.
Try to get the ball roll against him there and just couldn't get it off. Oh, there we go. There we go. Small little left sticks, get the finesse shot angle. The left stick was popping off nicely there, though. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay, guys. So, final verdict on the new Voller card. So, guys, uh, this card, you definitely have to give an engine chemistry style to, to try to improve uh, the base capabilities of the card as much as possible. I really wish... Here's what I'm going to say, okay? I really wish that for cards like this, especially for cards that are, you know, this expensive at 980k... They should give them the five star weak foot 100%. The reason why I'm saying this is because when you have three star skills in this game, it makes your play style a little bit more linear, right? Because you have to like really rely on left stick dribbling, which you guys know for me, I don't really care because that's like my play style anyways. But don't get me wrong, there's gonna be certain situations where having skill moves would be very helpful, but fine, doesn't have the skill moves, should have the five star weak foot. In my opinion, I really think that should be the case. However, even with the four star weak foot, his finishing was still pretty solid, right? Because base card stats for the card is in the mid 90s area, which is obviously very, very good for how the meta plays out. Because once you get those drag touches off, you get the finesse shot angle, that kind of stuff. His finishing does come off quite nicely, right? Uh, a lot of the shots that end up not working is honestly sensitivity issues with this game and unresponsive gameplay. It wasn't really like his fault, right? It's just uh, one of those types of things where you know, once you give this card the engine chemistry style, he just becomes a very good striker. He's definitely very solid. It is a card to pack more than it is to buy at that price range, of course, uh, because the price is definitely up there because of the, you know, lack of skill moves to be able to kind of utilize in the game. But yeah, if you're just going to be using like left stick dribbling, utilizing attacking AI, getting certain angles to take the shots off, the card is still very solid. Like if any of you guys end up packing him in some sort of future, um, you know, foot icon SBC or what, what are these things called again? The World Cup Heroes cards. He's really solid. It'd definitely be a W card to get in general. He's very, very nice. Um, super enjoyable. I was using him with the Al Awarin card. I already forgot his name. Um, and the combination play between the two was really, really sick to work with. I will say that the only things other than the skill move that's a little bit of a downfall is sometimes the average body type. Sometimes. It's really weird, right? Because in this game, his high dribbling stats compensates well for it. And dribbling works differently in this game where the average body type is not as big of a nuisance. You know what I'm saying? Like it's it still works out perfectly fine. Um, so yeah, definitely a W card in general. Really enjoyed using him. Scored a lot of goals with him. Really, really good positioning on the pitch. It's just the skill move thing, right? And the weak foot thing. It would be nice to give him the five-star weak foot if you don't plan on, um, you know, giving him the skill moves. If he was a four-star, four-star, a little bit different, but... Yeah, still a very good card. Really enjoyed using him. Guys, thanks for watching the video. I'll catch you guys for the next one. Peace out, dudes. Love you guys.